Whenever I see something like this, I've got to second guess myself and think that this could have been avoided. I mean, how many years has it taken to rot this piece of fascia board away from the roof? I mean, come on. So here's a tip for anyone who <coughs> wants to avoid a situation like this maybe you could fix the problem if you see something like this starting to develop and again whenever you let something like this go it's kind of like that old 50 cent washer you know ah that's you you if you would have just replaced this little washer that cost 50 cents you wouldn't have had the hundred thousand dollars worth of damage and again water attracts termites wood rot mold mildew fungus they all run hand in hand so if something like this and again it doesn't have to be fascia board it could be anything but if you have a problem like this where you starting to see some wood rot find the problem and fix it as soon as possible don't let it get this bad and then when it does get this bad fix it and if you don't got the money, um, I can understand that. Uh, there are other things you can do, you know. And again, a lot of that might relate back to getting some more information to find out what you can do. I mean, I, obviously, I would be. I'd have a one-hour video here on telling the people how to fix this without spending a lot of money. And who knows? Maybe them will come in the future. But the main point I'd like to make in this video is little damage usually gets larger if you can fix it when it's little it's not going to cost you as much however if you wait until it is larger it is going to cost more money so common sense remodeling home repairs you know think about it it makes sense to fix the problem before it gets big